Very nice guy and good family man. And then I find out as a youth that you stole things. And I find that very hard to believe. You, you just do not seem like the kind of guy that would steal. Uh, I, I think I know what you're talking about. I, I didn't see it as theft. It felt like an unspoken uh, agreement. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Why don't you explain? <laughs> you, you guys will see. When I first started out in the show business, mm -hmm. I was in my uh, early 20s, and uh, my wife and I uh, married 25 years, by the way. <laughs> I tell people, it feels like it's only been 10 minutes. Yeah. Underwater? <laughs> um, <laughs> You're right. Comes off as kind of a prick. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> that's a joke, a joke a doctor told me once. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I said, I'm going to use that. Um, listen, so here's the deal. When I, we, we lived in an a, a apartment in New York. We had a shower in our kitchen. We were broke. Right. And then I would get, uh, uh, thank God, I'd get these uh, lovely jobs where you go out and do a movie or a television thing, and they fly you first class, and they put you up in these lovely hotels. And uh, it was wonderful. And then you order, uh, you feel like you're living large. And then you order room service. And it's like 50 bucks for a f***ing omelet. Hey, take it easy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. By the way, that's not what you're supposed to do to the omelet. <laughs> <laughs> Guess what? <laughs> Andy, for 50 bucks, you do what you want. <laughs> Okay, that that's fair. That's you're on sure. the road, you're yeah, alone. Yeah, yeah. yeah. sure. Why so this not? is a, this yeah. is a big, you know, you're a poor... And it just, I just felt like there's no way they... The, the, the silverware must have been included. Mm -hmm. It's the way I looked at it. <laughs> there's no way... How could it not be? What are you paying for otherwise? <laughs> yeah. So I felt better by... Uh, I would take the silverware home. Uh, yeah. Uh, see, that seems reasonable, right? Yeah. Have you stayed in these hotels? There's no. no way the eggs, those are just eggs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's eggs and it's a coffee, so $50, right. it must include the silverware. <laughs> and so, I would... So Did you try to take the cart? Too? Yeah, yeah. I try to stay with the carry-on. Yeah, yeah, I'm right. Sure. So, I travel light. So, I used to, our silverware collection when we were uh, uh, starting out was all uh, silverware from hotels. And, mm -hmm. um, and they were great. They're really nice stuff. And so people would come over and they'd be like, oh, I, I love the fork here. And I'd be like, that's, that's from the standard. <laughs> <laughs> Wait till you see the spoons from the Waldorf. <laughs> um, so that's, that's the way we did it. That's very nice. Yeah. I think you did the right thing. Yeah. It is, it is crazy. You. It is crazy when, you, when you're traveling and you look at the bill for this crazy. stuff. It seems crazy. And by the way, here's the cool thing. The, uh, no one will ever call you on it. The hotel's never gonna be like, excuse me, uh, Mr. Oliphant, uh, we're missing a fork and a knife. <laughs> right, right, no. No, so that's why you know it's okay. I have a question. <laughs> <laughs> if it wasn't that's, okay, they'd say something. They would say something, yeah. They'd say, I'm sorry, but you can't take the silverware. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but they don't, Do so. you take the robe? Do you ever take the robe? Because a lot of times I see them about to take the robe and then it has a sign on it that says, if you'd like one of these robes, you may consult the front desk. That's a suggestion. <laughs> <laughs> so you don't go by. Andy, do you take the robe ever? Uh, no, I've never taken the. I, I've never taken the robe because I'm afraid they'll charge me, and it's it'll be like a hundred bucks. Yeah. For a stupid robe. Yeah. You know. Right. Hold on a second, though. Are you are you are you robe guys? You like no. you wear a robe? No. I would take the robe. I, I don't. I don't. I'm, do you I wear enjoy, a robe? I don't really enjoy the robe. I don't wear a robe. Every time I've gotten a robe, I, uh, the next thing I turn around, my wife's wearing it. She's like, "Thanks for the robe," and I'm like, "I, I thought it was my robe, but, I, yeah." Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> then you realize she's just stealing silverware with it. Yeah. yeah.